I'm out doing a yard again, another rental property, and it's been a while since we've seen there's no one's home. Uh, these people are not the cleanest, as you can see, and this thing's surrounded by weeds, and that is throwing off some very hot air. Uh, I got some coal rock going on down there. That's not good. The coil is not too terribly dirty. Copeland reciprocating compressor. Uh, a year or two ago, I had the fan motor replaced. At the time, I had some uh, idiot that shouldn't be doing heat and air, and uh, he did all that right there. But I've long since fired him. That's actually a OEM motor. That's a condenser fan motor seized up on it. Two and a oh, it's a three ton from 03. It looks lighter. And uh, that, that suction line is it's sweaty. Not very cold. <laughs> but uh, it's hooked up to a really old Coleman electric furnace that I had it rewired around the same time I had this uh, condenser fan motor put on and uh, the guy wired it incorrectly and something happened and the heat strips came on one day back this is this year in January the heat strips came on and they stayed on with no blower and that's what you call a furnace fire and that was Kind of frightening, but uh, long since got that fixed. It's hot out here and I can't think right right now. <laughs> or I tell the full story. Yeah, that coil's a little dirty. Well, I figured I'd show this unit. Got some serious coil rock going on down at the bottom. But uh, anyways, hope y'all enjoyed this little video. I'm not going to say where this particular property is located. But I filmed this unit before. But I'm going to get back on the roll and finish what I'm over here to do. See y'all later.